already been overridden. Travel well. Always find challenge. Anora, they're wise to let women rule, but only if they are worthy. Don't assume the hunt will be evil. Demands full Full already. We should get back out and track the herd if we want to maintain our reputations. We should head north. North where the ice and snow calls. In Banur, they already sing songs about the hunts I've completed. This is how the Banuk must have gotten up and down the mountain. The last hunt was a good one. Struck swift as snow, and none will be going hungry. doing here. Every idle moment is another mile between us and the herd. <laughs> Shaman, you're trying to understand the machines here too? Yes, Nora. And taking my time with my studies. Between you, me, and the spirits, I appreciate the peace. Not just from the machines. There are many changes in Ban Ur. The hunters and shamans bicker without end. What about? How best to deal with a harsher world. The hunters, they don't want it back the way it used to be. And we shamans find ourselves able to explain less and less. So many are exiles now, sent to wander. Here, no one argues. So, I welcome mystery. Perhaps the machines are glad to be separated from their herds, too. Greetings, Nora. I am Tikuk. Shaman, I've never seen anything like this. <laughs> the blue light is strong here. My people traveled far from the heights of Ban Ur to experience it for themselves. The blue light? The light of the machine spirits. It is all around us. It settles upon us. This is how it used to be. Before they grew angry. I... I know about the derangement, but... I didn't think the machines were ever this calm. What is it about this place? We don't really know. We sing, and we listen... to the machine songs. The machines... sing to you? To each other. You are a hunter. You must have heard. Their communions and hymns, their calls and cries. We're not meant to understand, but we shamans try to interpret. What is the song that angered them so, that turned them upon us? What song soothes them? Does it thrum in the air here, just outside of hearing? How can we heal the machine world? What's with the big guy? I was drawn to this place in a storm. At first, I thought the keening was the wind, snapping off the mountain's frozen face. But no, it was the Thunderjaw's song. I found it crouched on its haunches, its metal unmoving, and I took shelter beneath it. When the storm cleared, its singing done, 
Perhaps the spirit left its great shell, or perhaps it slumbers and remains. So we have not stripped and gleaned this one. We treat it with the care it is owed. Do you mind if I look around more, Tikuk? Speak, trade, listen. You are welcome. No harm will come to you here. So it's not the Banuk that are doing this. There's something about this place. They can't see it, but maybe my focus like can. I don't like spending so long away from the hunt. I don't like spending so long away. My focus might see something here. A place where the machines are tranquil. To see these machines up close like this, it's grazer dung. I'm sorry? Frozen grazer dung. This ravager led me here. I chased it down from the rivals where it killed a great ice hunter, tore him in two. The challenge I accepted, but when it reached this camp, the Fury left it. Isn't that a good thing? Tikuk says it's a gift. <sighs> what is a gift but a reward that you didn't earn? The machines are meant to challenge us. Now I'm stuck here guarding the shamans. Long health and hard ice. I can feel myself growing old. This grows. Anyone can feel the machines Focus we sure could we turn are. something up. There, signal. And the source is at the top of the mountain. I better look into it. the knowledge in the cauldrons to override these machines. The burnt hawks are just waiting. A good sign, I guess. Someone's been up here recently. Is that... Voices? Just leave us here! Did Vilgun send you? No. I guess shards can buy a conscience. <laughs> Never mind that. Nora girl, you have to stop the others. Up ahead, we snuck up, uncovered some kind of ancient device, plain as an anvil. That's what affects the machines. The other bungheads voted to take it to Pitchcliff for auction. But it's taken a beating already. Like it dropped from the sky. We tried to stop them digging it out. Without that thing up here, those Banuk will be massacred. I'll stop them. You two get out of here. It sounds like they're gonna die off damage. Well, that's a fair appraisal.
I let the rope slip for? You bunch of chuff skulls. The slack was on your Get away from that smoke. It's burned out. What have you done? Who are you? You're not one of those Banook. <sighs> Too late. Let me look at it. Hold on, hold on. This was our delve. We did the work. You want to put your axe in? What's this thing worth to you? I don't know about this. This was your idea. You started it, you can finish. All right. Could be this thing's just scrap, but even scrap has a price. So I'll ask again, what's it worth to you? It's worth more to me than you are. You still want to negotiate? Forget it. All he's ever given me is black toes. <sighs> They've made a mess of this. Catastrophic malfunction. This is from long ago. And it's been sending a signal all this time. Fading out. I have to get back to the camp. Before the machines tear it apart. They've already started attacking. The hunt is back. My song machine, a sharp song. I don't fear it. Now you'll hear my song, machine. A sharp song. Nora, did you know this change would come upon us? Not exactly. Although I know there is a lot changing in our world. This time it was outsiders. Those Asaram thought. The Asaram do not think. They will never understand the balance between us. Between man and machine. Now the blue light has gone. And we are left with many songs but more for mourning than gratitude. So what now? Will you go back to your homeland? When we teach the young to walk on shifting ice, we say the secret is taking one step, then the next. Perhaps one day we will understand the machine's mysteries. I hope so. Good luck, Teacook. The silence. This long hunt is over. <laughs> <laughs> 